Hello, my name is Mark Blocker. In this segment, we're going to cover how to replace an oxygen sensor. On this model vehicle, the oxygen sensor is mounted always in an exhaust manifold or exhaust tubing or down by the catalytic converters. And to remove them, it's a long spark plug looking device with a wire that comes out and that could be several wires on newer model cars and into the computer control system. First, we're going to need to dis oops. First, we're going to need to disconnect that by removing a clip and then sliding that out. Now we'll need to take the wire out of the holding bracket and remove that. Now we have access to simply remove the oxygen sensor itself. They make a specialty socket that's long and has a slot cut in it that'll allow the wire to hang out so you can use a socket and ratchet assembly and that can be had for about 30 bucks at any automotive supply or automotive parts house. Or you could use a standard box stand wrench. I recommend spraying down here because it goes into the oxygen or into the exhaust manifold and there's a lot of rust usually present with some penetrating oil and letting that sit for three or four minutes prior to removing the oxygen sensor. But by removing the wire, then you can simply take your box in wrench, I'm gonna turn this around, slide it down over the oxygen sensor and then slide it onto the base of it where you're gonna to need to remove. This is gonna give you a good biting all the way around the oxygen sensor better than the open end portion of the wrench itself. Okay, once you removed your old oxygen sensor, just simply uh, follow a reverse procedure for installing it. Your new oxygen sensor should come equipped with a lubricant on the threads. If it's not there, there should be a little packet in there, it's called anises, and just put a small amount of that lubricant on the threads prior to inserting the new oxygen sensor, and that'll help it to come out easier should it need to be replaced. And then make sure you put the wire in its clip holder, holds it out of the way, and then connect the wire back into the computer system. That's how you replace an oxygen sensor.